one. Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, it's supposed to be Tish Talk, but it's been a day. <laughs> The person I had lined up backed out on me, which is fine. It, it's life. And computer issues and storms and people mowing lawns and just everything, chaos. So we're just going to paint tonight and just talk about life and have a good time. I am here with my buddy, my pal, my love, my darling, my executive producer, Michael. Say hello, Michael. Oh, I thought you were talking about someone else. <laughs> wow. I was. I thought, man, I, I want to meet this person. <laughs> Every time. Every time. Hello, everyone. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. He says that with such conviction. Mm. <laughs> you mean it's only Tuesday? <laughs> it's, yeah. <laughs> we we should be much further along into the week towards the weekend. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm with mm. you on that one. Okay, so we're gonna play around with some of these Montmartre paints. I have I'm gonna leave it up to the chat what color I have one more little cup ready to mix some other color to go with the colors I already have. I don't have Prussian blue, Doris, if Doris is in the chat. Oh, hey, we probably should say hello to the people in the chat, shouldn't we, Michael? Yeah, yeah, we uh, have, gosh, we've got quite a turnout tonight. Oh, awesome sauce. And let's see here. We have, mm, of course, as always, the lovely, vivacious Cheryl is here tonight. Yay. Hey, and we also have... Um, Julia is here tonight, and my man, Trey, from Trey. Max World Entertainment. Hello, little brother. Yay! Yay! <laughs> and let's see, who else do we have here? Oh, hey, look at that. It is my cousin from North Carolina, Diane. Diane Kay is here. Hello, hey. Diane. Hey. Uh, the wonderful Gina Bina. And also, let's see, who else do we have here? We have, oh, Jan with uh, Serendipity Soul. Hello, uh, Jan. And also we have, mm, let's see. I feel like there's somebody else in here that I'm trying to. Oh, well, there's Doris. Oh, hey, Hello, Doris. Doris. Oh, uh, Infinity Manifestations. That is Mrs. Mack. That is Nicole, Oh, if I remember that's correctly. That's right. Because she that, has her own channel now. That is it. Art by Nicole. That is, yes, that's, that deserves that. <laughs> Very much so congratulations, Nicole. Yeah, I did. I saw that. So we want to give her a big two thumbs up. Way to go. Any colors? Anybody? 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 Otherwise, I'm going to do purple because I got it in my hand. <laughs> Jelly Duck is here. Hello, Jelly. Hello, hello. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Not seeing any colors yet. Okay. Because uh, I'm yet. thinking either blue or purple. But I'm kind of thinking purple because I'm that girl. Okay. Gina Bina says purple sounds good. Okay. Okay. If, as long as Gina yep. Bina says it's okay, then yep. we're going to roll with it. <laughs> Libby's Chicken Ranch. <gasps> Libby is Libby. here. Libby is in North Dakota. She's my other neighbor on the okay. other side. When I'm home, that is. So she, her vote, vote is for orange. She vote, votes orange. I got orange. orange. Okay. I've already got magenta, uh, vermilion, raw sienna, and viridian. I've got 24 karat gold and titanium white as well. 
So okay, Julia says gold. Um, Diane says purple, of course. Okay. Yeah. We got two votes for purple. We're going purple. Okay. Because, you know, purple is purplicious. There we go. So I've got two ounces of Floetrol in this little kit. And I just put an ounce of paint in there. And that's what I'm finding that these Montmark paints um, mix well at is two to one. Um, and I am using American Floetrol and no water. If it's a little bit thick, I will add a little bit of Floetrol on water to it because I will give you guys, I don't normally do this. Normally I make you wait a week, but I will grab one of the tiles from last night. So you guys can see how awesome they dried. This does need a little bit of Floetrol and water, which is over here anyway. So let me grab this one. So I want to give a shout out to Positive Candor. Hello, hello, hello. So here is the one that we did last night. And I think it turned out really cool, the layers of color in there. And once we put some clear coat and resin on these babies, yeah. Of course, I got to clean them because they got silicone in them. But... Oh, Jay's here. One angry attack. <gasps> Hello, Jay. Good to see you. He says, I'm DMing you on Discord. Oh, okay. And Karen is here. Karen, welcome. Glad Hello. That you're here. Hello. She's a newbie here. She says, I signed my artwork as Karen Lee. Awesome. I don't, you know, when I sign my artwork, I sign it just with my initials. Um, cause I've, I've been doing that since I was in high school and I have a certain way of signing my initials. So to me, that's just like any kind of fancy art signature. There we go. That's a little better. Got to grab a little red cup cause we're going to do the purple. We're going to put one ounce of paint in here. And then one drop of silicone as well. So we have a little bit of a little bit with silicone and a little bit without. And I would put it all in there, but sometimes I just like to have the color without the silicone. So there's that. Let's move this guy out of the way. These guys out of the way. Somewhere. There we go. That's a good spot for it. So these were all mixed up yesterday. I'm just going to give them a quick little stir. No folding fish. No folding. It's a downfall of being a pastry chef. Because I want to fold everything. Just stir, stick up, and swirl it a boot. Sorry, my northern Minnesota is showing. Hey. Hey. Don't you know? I close it. <laughs> Dude. I've been having problems with my hands not wanting to work because I uh, <clears throat> spent too much time typing today. That's what happens when you moderate too many channels. <laughs> Joy. But I learned some stuff today because Daniel Batal did a live Filmora training today. And that was an adventure. Let's just put it that way. And then vidIQ, I also learned something as well. Not something that pertains to me, 
because I'm not monetized yet, but something that pertains to those that are monetized, I guess they rolled out, YouTube rolled out a new feature to find out how much you make per ad and to figure out all that. So I thought that was pretty cool. And there goes my phone because I did not turn off my notifications. You know, I'm not for sure if we said hello to Angela or not, but she's been here. Well, hello, and Angela. So hello, Angela. Glad you're here. Yeah. Okay. Wonderful to see all our friends here at the Haven. And if you're new here, I just want to take a moment and welcome you. Thank you for joining us tonight. I appreciate you taking time and stopping in. If you're lurking in the background and unsure, please just pop into the chat, say hello. Um, the people there are wonderful. We have the greatest group here. I'm, I'm not kidding you. They're the most wonderful people ever, ever, ever. And um, they'll make you feel welcome. But also, if you're enjoying the vibe and want to join a little creative tribe, all you got to do is click that subscribe, hit that notification bell, and that'll let you know when we go live. Because guess what? We go live six days a week, 7 p.m. usually. Um, I do do a Thursday morning, 9.30 a.m. I almost said p.m. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Um, I do do a 7 or 9.30, oh, good Lord, I'm not doing a 7.30 live. I haven't had enough coffee by then. Um, but I do do a live at 9.30 for beginners. So if you have questions or um, you're unsure of a, uh, of a step or you want me to try out some paint, a certain color combination, you guys let me know what you want me to do, especially on Mondays and Thursdays. Those are the days to ask me questions. Those are the days to... Let's let's figure this all out, you know. So um, I'm actually going to do the white and the gold last. We're going to start with purple and work our way over. Um, I'm going to do the purple first since we have the most of it. Put a couple of little driblets in there. But how is everybody tonight? I mean, <clears throat> it's only Tuesday, but it feels like it should be Friday. And it's just been a little bit crazy. So I'm going to use the silicone for purple. We're going to use just a straight up magenta. No silicone in this. I'm going to kind of alternate them and see what happens with the cells. I'm just curious, has anybody heard from Blair? If you're new to the channel, you don't know who Blair is, but for y'all old timers out there, <laughs> um, Blair just kind of disappeared and I hope she's okay. I know Tina Poo pops in once in a while. But there's some really cool people that we've had on our channel. Great supporters. And, you know, if you want to help out the Haven and support the Haven, um, keep us in paint. Keep me in paint. Keep the Artapaloozas coming. There are multiple ways to do that. You can do an artist boost right here in the live. You can buy me a coffee. You can join Patreon for as little as $3 a month. And my favorite thing, though, honestly, is when y'all buy me stuff on Amazon and send it to me and I get some happy mail because normally my mail is bills and advertisements. And that gets a little bit redundant and boring. OK, so this is glue. There's not Floetrol in this. This is I, I made a gigantic batch of glue and water with the white so we're going to use this up too then we're going to put the gold let's put a little bit more weight in here I'm trying to make them about even that looks about right
is that. And this is gold with the, the Elmer's glue all. I did 70% glue, uh, glue and 30% distilled water. Okay, they're about the same. So <clears throat> I'm just going to do a flip, a flip, a flip. So Patty Puckett is joining us from Pouring Art. Hello, Patty. D and D Art Gallery. Hello, hello. Wonderful to see you. And let's see who else. Oh, look at there, Sue Ashworth. Hello, my Aussie friend. Good day. Good day. I sound more British than I do Australian. <laughs> I can't do it. I'm sorry. I need to go watch Crocodile Dundee or something like a hundred times to get pounded in my head. I think I've got some Mad Max movies. Ooh, ho, ho. There we go. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's do this. We're going to do one at a time here, I think. No, you know what? We're going to do them all. I'm just going to flip them all. Well, that one kind of came off. That's so weird because the gold was last and yet it's on top. I'm trying to figure that one out. All right, we're just going to pull this one straight up. Oop. Whoops. There we go. We're going to get all kinds of cool stuff on these, I think. Oh, wow. Yeah, Sue. Man from Snowy River. That is a wonderful movie. Yeah, I, I totally agree. That, I don't that, recall if I've ever seen it. a movie to watch. Yeah. Is that a Mel Gibson movie? Is that why? No. No, but it's, it's, it's really good. Okay. I'll take your word for it. And Creative Escapes. Kim is here. Hello, Kim. Trying not to mess up the other tiles here. And these are just four by four tiles. I get the ones at Lowe's just because they don't have the little, I don't know, little additions on the sides. They're straight up side. So they, um, they just they just finish off better. <clears throat> that was an adventure going to Hobby Lobby and Lowe's. I got paint on the back of my hand. Tell me how I do that. <laughs> <laughs> but you, but you could, if anyone could. I know you. <laughs> it would be me because I'm so good at making messes. Absolutely. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Thanks. All right, we're going to bring this down. And Andy Marshall is here. Well, hello, Andy. It has been forever since I've seen you, sir. Well, let's hope that there's some cells going to come out in this one, because this one looks pretty bland. Well, I'll just see what happens. It's the joy of food art. You just, you never... It's like you never know what you're going to get. At least a box of chocolates, you have a chance of having a little list in there and pictures that tell you what might be inside. This, yeah, you never know. 
All right. Andy is my other Australian friend, and he is illustrating a children's book. As long as I have the right Andy. No too many Andys. Oh, I like this one. It looks like we've been joined by a wandering, um, wandering art. Well, hello. Let's get this down here. Okay, I gotta That's remember. turning out nice. I remember to do it in front of the camera. I'm so like, <laughs> I'm not used to working on little tiles and making a mess. Well, I am used to making a mess. That's one thing. It's like, I don't mind messes, but my kitchen, my kitchen has to be spotless. My kitchen has to be organized and the rest of my house can be all chaos. My kitchen has to be clean. Run this way first. There we go. I'm going to coax this one down. See, I don't. I, I'm kind of sad about that one. Might have to do a re, re pour on that one. You know, we've got a lot of acreage in the back, and I do have a shotgun, so like maybe for a clay pigeon, a decorative clay pigeon. Thanks, no, babe. I, no, I, I actually <laughs> like them. I like all of them. I, I want to start that one, there's putting them around to and having them out for, <laughs> for drinks and. We're gonna have to yes. have a have a cocktail party. Yes, we'll yeah. have to have a cocktail party and tell people they have to buy their coaster. <laughs> yeah, Diane says she act, she loves the one with the least color. So, thank well, you, we'll Diane. See we'll see what happens because, like I said, I, I I like playing and trying different things, and I'm not a big silicone user, but it seems with the Montmark paints, if you want cells you have to use silicone or dimethicone, which you can either use the coconut milk serum, hair serum, or Astroglide. They're both dimethicone. I personally like the Astroglide better because it cleans off easier. All right, here we go. Freckles! Karen was saying that you could pour that second one again or mix it all in the center and see what you get. I was thinking. Let's because I tipped the cups up inside of each other here. I think I'm just going to go. Oops. <laughs> Can't say that's a great idea, a cocktail party. And <laughs> it, it will be a BYOC. <laughs> Bring your own coaster. coaster. Yep. All right, let's try this. I think it's partially that glue. Glue does not like me. I like this better though. 
there. That's why you don't see me using glue in a lot of my paintings, but I want to use it up. I might actually just kind of <clears throat> mix it up and dilute it out somehow. I'll figure it out. I always do. I like that. Oh, yeah, I like that much better. That's a, a lot more color. It's a lot more fun. Pop some bubbles there. I noticed some bubbles. All right, let's do some close-ups here. Oh, yeah, Cheryl um, was reminding us. Andy has a question about these. Do you have an online store where these are available? I will have one by August 1st. That is my goal and my intention is to have that up and running by August 1st. There is a website. If you go to uh, happenstancefurniture.com, um, that is my site. Um, the artist haven shop will eventually get you there. <laughs> I haven't bought the, the link or whatever it's called domain name yet. Um, but that's what I'm in the process of doing right now. Um, I'm just figuring out how exactly to do it all. But that's the one that was bland. I like it much better now. It's got a lot more color to it. Andy, thank you for the question. Cheryl, thank you for reminding me of that. Cheryl is on the ball. She is, always. See, and this is why I think it's the glue that's giving me the, the problem. It's because the white is being really weird, and so is the gold, and those are the only two. Yeah, that looks, yeah. I mean, it looks it looks cool. Yeah, it's just weird. And I don't. I mean, I'm weird, so I'm rolling with it. Oh, and Monica is here. Hello, Monica. Good to see you, my friend. See, like that right there. That looks weird. I don't know if I like that. But the thing about coasters is if you don't like what you have on them, you can soak them in hot water and a little bit of vinegar and the paint peels right off. It's amazing. That's why you have to seal them and then seal them in resin. Otherwise, the paint will peel right off. So <laughs> this is just kind of the first of many layers. And other things you can do is you can put vinyl decals on them to embellish them. You can put, you know, like someone's monogram on them. Um, you can do all kinds of cool things with coasters. And that's why I've been working on them. Because um, I want to be able to do some holiday gift giving ideas. I know, I know it's only July. But I actually thought when I was packing up to come to Michael's house, I actually thought of bringing my Christmas ornaments with so I could just play around with those. But because I have about, I don't know, a hundred or so that I can make up. And yeah, I, 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 I opted for my KitchenAid mixer instead. So I think that was a good choice. So are there any further questions in the chat, Michael? Let me take a look and see here. Um... Oh, you know, I may have overlooked this. Not so much a question, but um, Celine is here tonight with us. So awesome. I want to say hello to her. Yay! Yay! Let's see. Do we have Hi. any other questions? Nope. Everybody's just talking about how much they are enjoying the coasters and how wonderful they look. Awesome. They, um, they will be for sale on my website, <laughs> depending on how they dry. I'm, I'm curious to see how they dry. Those first ones, I those ones will be for surely on sale because I, I love those. Those, I think, turned out great. These ones, I'm just going to wait and see what happens with them tomorrow. Okay, so let's see. We do have a question. When is Tish doing a resin pour again? <laughs> Who said that? Uh, <laughs> J-O-T-Z Designs. Oh, that's Elisa. Elisa. Yes, Miss Elisa. <laughs> um, you will be proud to know, Elisa, that I ordered some resin because I accidentally left my resin behind along with 
uh, a couple of resin paintings that I was going to finish off. Um, it was in a, in a tote and I forgot to snag it. I don't know where I'd put it though. But anyways, I did bring my resin stuff. I do have resin on order and as soon as it gets here, I will be playing on some coasters. Um, so you will be very proud of me. I'm trying it again. Elisa was kind and patient enough to try and teach me resin, but I think I can't be taught. So <laughs> I think it's one of those things where I just have to muddle through and figure figure it out. I figure if I can do royal icing and if I can do fondant and if I can make a Genoa cake from scratch, uh, which is more difficult than making an angel food cake from scratch, I can do just about anything. So, and I can do resin, damn it. But, I mean, I have I have Elisa, who is amazing, amazing resin artist. And I have um, uh, Clara, who is an amazing resin artist. And um, Erica from ATD, another amazing resin artist. All these people have offered to help me figure it out. So, I, you know... I'll figure it out. I want to know when she's going to use that fire glass. That's the Elisa. What are you going to do with all that fire glass? <laughs> now, Diane has a quick question. She okay. wanted to know, do you have any of the videos on the ornaments? On the ornaments? No. That is something I have not done yet on um, the channel. Um, that was something that last year I was going to do, but... Um, time constraints and just life in general never really happened um it never really happened but um if i can get my hands on some i will do some while i'm here if not i'll figure it out but um it does involve some fluid art so i it does try tie into the channel so i feel safe in doing it Oh. Okay, and then we have a question from Tracy. Thank you, Cheryl, for passing this one on from Tracy. What was your mix that you used here? Um, the mix for these colors here was two parts Floetrol, American Floetrol, and one part Montmark paint. And then these two here were... Um, uh, a glue mix of 70% glue, 30% water. And then I think these are two to one. This is a titanium white master's touch. This is um, Hobby Lobby's brand. Um, and then this is 24 karat gold from Deco Art. Um, and I did those, I, I wanna say they were two to one. I didn't write it down cause yeah, I couldn't find my Sharpie and I was frustrated because <laughs> glue is not my friend. I think it's too closely related to tape. Because <laughs> I tape and I are not friends either. You should see me on packaging day. I cuss more at my <laughs> at my tape gun than should be legally allowed. <laughs> but it gets done. It just takes me a while. And Monica, to answer your question, Tish is here in Illinois. She's uh, come for a visit here at my place. And that's where we're at here in the lovely state down south, out the southern in, part of Illinois. Out in the country out where the country. it's quiet, no sirens, no traffic, no trains, just, you know, the occasional dog barking, dog barking <laughs> or cats screeching at each other or, you know, it's just, it's so wonderful out here. I'm so grateful that Michael invited me down here and, and we're learning about each other's life and all the things that we know about YouTube and sci-fi and art and comic cons and just all kinds of cool stuff. So it's been really great being here. Um, and Rhea loves it here too. She has this big area to run around in instead of her little tiny room. So um, she did weather the trip well, I would say. All right, well, I got everything packaged up. I will, um, 
If these turn out, these will be on <laughs> the website. If not, I will pour, do another pour and so we have coordinating ones and they might be slightly different. So we'll see what happens. Crossing fingers, praying to the paint gods. Um, and let me say again, if you're new here, welcome. Thank you for joining us. I appreciate you. If you're enjoying our vibe and want to join the Little Artist Tribe, all you got to do is click that subscribe, hit the notification bell, because we do go live six days a week, and you're always welcome to say howdy in the chat, ask your questions. If I don't get to it or Michael doesn't see it, <clears throat> someone in the chat is surely to have the answers. We have a lot of knowledgeable people in our chat, and, you know, they all, I think the vast majority of them all have channels as well, um, that you should go visit. There are links down in the description box below for a lot of the people that come on to our channel for Artapalooza, for Tish Talks, for Flip Cup Nights, for just Saturday Night Shenanigans, just because we invite all kinds of people from all walks of life to come on the, the channel and share with us their talent. Um, if you ever have any questions, leave them in the comments below, or you can go to our Facebook page at the artist haven and then join our group but first like the page then click join group answer the questions and you'll be welcomed into the tribe there so that's all i got for you tonight thank you for joining me i appreciate you remember be kind to one another peace love and happiness <laughs>